As the government continues to play the silent role in the finance in the NCN financial probe, the Alliance for Change is pushing for the document to be made public. The auditors were calling after it was discovered that the CEO and the production manager were involved in financial irregularities that are not in keeping with the company policies. Cathy Hughes, executive member of the party and member of parliament, said that the AFC has been asking for the report to be made public for a while now. I think what we've been asking for um, recently is that the report be made public. So that is one of the things we're looking for. I think everything that happens speaks for itself. We may want to say that there's just a perception of corruption, but we all know that it's a reality. The CEO, Fossi Sattara, was forced to resign while the production manager, Martin Gulseran, was sent on leave pending the outcome of the probe. That was several months ago. And what we've been focusing on within the AFC, in Parliament, is not to make it difficult. We're not here to just make things difficult and to be unproductive. We want to bring accountability back, and that is what we're focusing on. The combined opposition voted to reduce NCN eight to one million dollar budget to a dollar. In the views of the opposition, taxpayers fund NCN. Therefore, citizens must not be subjected to the PPP government propaganda on the national network. The opposition members are contending that their views are not carried by NCN. Coverage of national events does not include the opinions, thoughts, ideas, or any form of constructive criticism by members of the opposition. Reporting for Capital News, Royston Drakes.